We continue to track Tropical Storm Elsa. We want to go back to Key West where the rain really has just been relentless. Yeah, CBS 4's Ted Scowling joins us live with the conditions now. Ted. Hi, Maribel and Francis. Well, you know, with the rain, we've gotten a little bit of a break from it where it stopped uh, for just a few minutes. It's starting, to, it's starting up once again uh, just as we're coming on. We're also getting some more gusts, uh, some of the stronger gusts that we've seen today. Let me uh, show you behind me what some of those gusts of wind have done. You can see there's a few tree branches that are down here. Not huge branches, but uh, would cause for flying debris. Right next to it, there's a sign uh, that's been partially knocked down from the wind. So. You can see we've definitely have been getting uh, some good gusty winds here. Now, if you look over a little bit further to the right, it's a little bit difficult to see when someone's not driving through it, but uh, there's a lot of standing water on the road. That's one of the concerns that they have here in Key West is with all that rain, that, that there's going to be a street flooding. I spoke to the mayor. The mayor told me that, yes, uh, there has been street flooding in areas that are known for street flooding. So that's what we're seeing here. This is uh, right near the pier. Uh, the White Street Pier in Key West. So uh, as people are driving around town, they're finding sometimes it's difficult to get through, of course, very dangerous trying to get through standing water because you don't know if there's a power line in there. You don't know uh, actually how deep that water is and if you'll be able to make it through or stall out. Once again, though, we uh, had been getting a little bit of a break from the rain. However, it's starting up again, and so is the wind. We expect it to continue as the storm is close to Key West. Live in Key West, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News. And Ted, we see you're in a parking lot, mostly empty as it should be, but there there are some people there. We see some cars, some people just running around. Uh, any idea what they're doing? I mean, are, are they just taking pictures or, or what's going on there? Well, it's kind of a thing here in Key West to go out to the end of the pier when there's a storm, which is uh, very dangerous to do, but a lot of people do that. That's just something that's, that happens here. Uh, we spoke to someone who just came back from out there, and it, it's, it's a good clip out there. And uh, what he was telling us is that the water appears to be uh, kind of thigh high out there. So uh, definitely flooding out there from all mm -hmm. the uh, waves and water from the ocean being pushed onto the pier. All right, Ted, thank you. Hopefully you'll be able to take a break. You deserve it and mm -hmm. get, uh, get out of that wet clothes. Thank you so much.